Well, we had, uh, right, you can see that Aquastat is rusted right there. Yeah, you probably can't see it. It's rusted right there. This, this darn thing popped a hole right in the middle of the line. So, and had to shut off the water of the house because that valve broke. So, I got to replace this valve. I got to rebuild this. And I got this massive pump back here, which shouldn't even be there. Oh, this is tight, very tight. Hmm. Oh, and there's 45 involved. Oh, let's see. I think what I'll do, I gotta get this valve out of here. I ain't got no room to cut it or nothing. I think what I'm gonna do is cut this as tight as I can here. 90 back that way, 90 across, put the valve in. And come back over here and cut this right here. This, let's see. I am going to do cut that right there within a foot. Yeah, water was just, luckily we had a sun pump right here. So water was just spewing out everywhere. So, I don't know how long it's been going on. The wall's pretty wet. Water on the vacuum. So let me go out to the truck. I'm gonna cut a piece of one, one foot piece of pipe, put a valve on it, put the jack valve in there. And I'll couple this, cut this right here, couple it right there. But I don't have a press check valve, so I gotta go solder that one together. What a job. And I got a new Aquastat on here, going on here too. Okay, let's get that out of the way. We're on the river again today. I do a lot of work on the river. No freighters. Ah, watch out, bird. Let me get the pipe out, solder it up, and then I'll, I'll get back to you here. It's kind of a crappy day outside. Let's see, grab a pipe cutter. piece of pipe I'll do it right here. Well, I guess I'm gonna do this right now
Oh, there we go. Oh, good old Ferguson. Out. Where's my check valve? Oh, there's my check valve. So, arrow's going that way. So let's do this. Put this on here. this shit I probably should have freaking soldered that first but oh well she'll live So that is going to go like that. My flow is going to go like this. Little arrow. How the heck am I going to hold this? I guess we're going to be soldering on the ground. Great. sit up there doesn't want to sit up there it's not sitting for that that don't work that don't work piece of paper I should have got the whole thing if you're still on there. <coughs> it's not the prettiest thing, let me tell you.
freaking gumpy. Freaking gumpy. Okay, we'll do it again here. Doesn't look like it's sealing. There we go. sealed all the way. Oh, it's hot. I need some water. Ah, ooh, steam. It's not very hot up there, so. All right, we're gonna let that cool down and then I'll get back down there and cut it apart. Okay, I'm gonna be the first to say that I am not a plumber. I know enough to be dangerous. I can fix stuff. I can fix this, but technically this is kind of plumber work, sort of. It's just in a bad, bad spot. water here over some pump hopefully they don't drop any tools and this is probably gonna it's probably still kind of filled with water oh geez who did this it's downright bad. Huh, yeah, you see the water dripping out of the control. What the hell is on there? There's something else on there. Let's 
so... Let's do some hack and slash. Oh, let's cut her loose right there. pre-made piece the arrows pointing that way I can trim this back some too and we'll cut that right there this might have some water gives me fits on half inch pipe. Probably cut it too long. This side done. Okay. Do I have the play? Ouch. I'm gonna have to cut a little more off. that way let's press let's press baby guys seen but it is tight back there it's always the tightest spot <clears throat> always the tightest spot uh, Okay. Gotta get this 
hanger out of the way. That stupid valve busted. Get her tight here. Behind every pipe under the sun. just keeps on spinning. <sighs> let's see, let's see, let's see. Street 90s. Oh, jeez, that's bad. Hell, I could just do that. You guys cannot see this. Oh, well, that lines up. Sometimes, eh, that looks like an asshole. I don't have any street 90s. Shut the whole house off. Uh, we need it right there. Right there, right there. Because the stupid valve. Stupid. Well, because the valve wouldn't shut. 
There we go. That's better. I can get a valve in there. I think. Oh, she's tight, baby. She's tight. There, got some play. Got some play. Oh, jeez. Thank God I don't have to solder this crap. <sighs> if I can get the press back there, jeez, oh beats. <sighs> I can't even reach back here. It's always got to be behind something. Always. Old pipe works for something. Oh, jeez, I can't even reach. shit you gotta put up with. I got the 12 volt press because the 18 press wouldn't fit back here. I can barely fit back here. Oops, didn't get the valve too level, but ain't no one gonna see it. Oh, can't get my arm out. Okay, can I get water back onto the house? And that would be a yes. You know, kind of, this valve sketches me out too. Uh, 
I don't trust that valve. I do not trust that valve. That sounds like it's working. Man, everything, this big freaking house, everything's got to be jammed into this mechanical room. Fuck it. I don't trust that. I do not trust it. I got a feeling I'm going to get water back on this thing. Hopefully the pipe cutter is waterproof. Easy as that. This makes me feel better. Makes me feel better. So I guarantee I'd get water back on it. And it wouldn't work. I guarantee it. Ooh. And that sucks. Everything's jammed in here here. Let me rebuild it. Let me rebuild it. Not a big deal. And we'll stick a 90 over here. Let's see. I got a tape measure. Got a piece of pipe. Oh yeah. 90. Let's see how long we gotta be. So I'm at seven and a half. There. Now I feel better. Because when I know when I turn the water back on, it's going to work. I like the swivel head on this. So let me turn the water back on. Okay, the dock water shut off. That shut off. That shut off. That shut off. <sighs> let me get some water back on it. Oops, wrong way. Is there a light in here? Here we go. Mm -hmm. Let's open 
that's open. Uh oh. Oh, I got the sink on, that's why. How much comes out of that? You guys still on? I guess so. Ooh. Ooh. Look good today. Put the water run, gotta have some air in the lines. That's on. That's on. That's on. <laughs> I kind of screwed myself. Should be okay though. Put that aqua stat right there. Let's see. Let's open up these lines. Oh baby. Whoa. Oh baby. Oh. Man, I shut the drain valve off. Dumbass. Like, what the hell is going on? Let's try this again. There we go. And we are watertight. I just got to get the aqua step put on there. I'm good. This video is getting long, so we're going to call it right here. All I got to do is that strap on aqua step, plug the pump in, psh, done. So at least I got water back onto this house. All right, guys. Sorry about the long video, but hey, sometimes that's what it takes. But 12 inch that. 12 volt pro presses man if i had 18 volt i wouldn't be able to get in there it's a little slower but it works see you on the next one well we got this I, I just did the repair up here this thing's been leaking for a while rusted up so let's see I got my neutral coming in here, my ground. Oh, jeez. Damn thing's all wet. There we go. And they got this on. I don't know. I don't know. It's got to be close, close, close on rise. I think. Let's see how they get this thing wired. Oops, found oh, spell. And RMB opens on temp rise. RW, so they had it close on rise. This thing's a rust bucket. Gotta go get another fitting. I don't like these freaking atomic fittings or whatever the heck they call them. Oh, it's a piece of junk. I know I'm going to lose something today. Down the pit. 
Wouldn't be a wouldn't be a day without adventure. Oh yeah. My back's getting tired. Sat there and pro pressed all this crap. No. I'm still leaning over. Holy shit. Oh, let me go get my other Aquastat. Okay, what I did is I put some foam tape around those sharp edges because that's what actually screwed up that, uh... Hey, are you sneaking up on me? Okay, out of here. Come on. This is my bathroom. Come on, out. Dog was sneaking up on me. Just this. Like I said, I put some foam tape on there. It's really not gonna hurt it too much, but I gotta get these wires back in there. Okay, so these wires, pump wires. small little less than one amp pump actually the pumps too big for what we're doing for some reason people need oh the bigger the better pump no where's your pipes out especially on recirculation and honestly it's not even right pump it's a cast pump I'm potable See if they want to change it, but I doubt it. It cost them like seven hundred dollars or something. I don't know. Bronze pumps aren't cheap. Oh, I'm gonna stretch. Oh, that that pipe's hot, baby. Sucks. I got. Oh, I'll put it right there. Oh, wow, that pipe's hot. I screwed myself. Oh, jeez. Oh, that pipe is scorching. Pipe is scorching hot. I gotta get this tie down there. Of course, I'll lose this nut in the sump. I will. It's guaranteed. There it goes. Didn't even try. Oh, there goes the knot. Let me fish him out. Oh, that's a long ways down there. No, no fishing. Here, let me be careful. Careful again. Oh my god. I had to use the old stuff. Plus you guys can't see. It seems like the gas pipe's in the way. As soon as I set it, sure enough, it goes in the drink. It goes in the drink. I know myself too good. Because the screwdriver is going to end up in there too if I'm not careful. I'm gonna 
get it out of there best I can. It doesn't want to play well. It doesn't want to play well. Come on. Oh, that's as good as you're going to get. Oh, my back. So, my cord. thing so tight. Oh. There. Ouch. Hot water. Hot water. I'm just leaning over the tank. That's why it's taking so long. This thing is not on a timer. It's just straight running consistently all the time. Tightest spots. Everything's in a tight spot. Had the expansion tank last week. That was a joy. This thing is not. Uh, it's a backbuster, man. Come on. And I can't see. You guys can probably see. You're on my forehead peeking around the corner. Wish my eyes were there. Oh. So we we're just switching the hot. So we're going to remake these connections. I don't know why they have 12 wire in here. It's dumb. Honestly, we're going to thin this wire out a little. Just take your strippers and thin it out. Yeah, you're not supposed to do it, but I do. Right, take them. There we go. Here, let me lean over this a little more. So I need W, there's W. 
you can wire it up, close on rise, or open on rise. We want close on rise, because we want the pump to come on when it heats up. a little more <sighs> oh that's hot oh. oh pipe is hot Oh jeez. Oh, little sh Why do people jam shit in here? Totally jam it in here. lost the screw. Almost. Almost. I'm gonna lose my mind in a second, man. This fucking pipe's hot. Oh my lord. Losing my mind. Pipe won't stay still. Nothing is working. Nothing. Faster. wires in the little box big wires little box wish Honeywell would get on a stick and stop investing in stupid screws that are outdated Down to 65 right now. Oh, yeah, will it work? There, heard it click. Yeah, the pump should come on. There we go, pumps on. And I'll give it a second, see if he comes back. I gotta get cleaned up. Oh, my back is killing me. Okay, so. Got everything back together. What I had to do is I had to shut that valve right there. I got a bleeder back there. I had to bleed that line. It had a ton of air in it. But she's pumping. She got recirculation and no leak. So she's good to go right now. And that's it for this one. What a pain. I got it, you know, I got right here and I got about another 10 inches 
and then trying to get over here the whole time just a pain my legs are killing me my back's killing me all right that's it that's it for this one just kind of uh redoing the aquastat on the on the recirculation line that's the way they want to run it continuous all the time but i recommended the pump because it's not the right pump too big of a pump and it's not it's not bronze or stainless so it's going to get you're going to go through pumps a lot all right i'll see you in the next one